Commercial sales contracts often call for performance over extended periods. In Eastern Airlines Incorporated versus McDonnell Douglas Corporation, we explore what happens if changed circumstances make a seller's performance impracticable. In 1965, Eastern Airlines entered multiple contracts to purchase 99 airplanes from Douglas Aircraft, which later became McDonnell Douglas Corporation. The contracts included excusable delay causes, stating that Douglas wasn't responsible for delays from causes outside its control, including, but not limited to, certain specifically identified causes, such as government acts or priorities. Over the production period, planes were routinely delivered about 80 days late, and after the final delivery, Eastern presented Douglas with a claim for damages caused by the delays. When Douglas refused to pay, Eastern sued Douglas for breach of contract. Douglas responded that Eastern couldn't recover because it failed to give timely notice of the breaches. Alternatively, Douglas argued that the delays were due to causes outside of its control, and the excusable delay clauses therefore prevented liability. Douglas stated that the delays were primarily attributable to the escalating Vietnam War, which prompted government requests that the aviation industry prioritize military production. Although such priority was sometimes attained using formal directives, it was largely attained via jawboning or pressuring the manufacturers using informal requests, accompanied by threats of formal action. The judge instructed the jury that Eastern wasn't required to prove it provided timely notice of the breaches because Douglas knew the deliveries were late. The judge also instructed that only formal government priority demands could render a delay excusable and only if not reasonably foreseeable at contracting. The jury held in Eastern's favor. Douglas appealed to the Fifth Circuit.